There were so many issues during UTEP's winless 2017 campaign that it's impossible to pinpoint just one problem that stands out above the rest. The Miners were better on defense than they were on offense, but the defensive line failed to generate a pass rush for the entire season. UTEP recorded a paltry 11 sacks in 2017, which was second to last in college football. But get this, only one of those 11 sacks came from a UTEP defensive lineman. The rest were by linebackers and defensive backs. That is abysmal. So Dana Dimmel is putting an emphasis on generating a pass rush by the defensive line this year. And he thinks switching from a three-man front to a four-man front will help. For us to have the type of defense we want to have, we're going to have to create pressure by just four-man rushes, too, you know, and so the D-line's got to get some work on that, and so we know how important it is for us to do that, and we feel like we've been emphasizing that. We're going to have a couple segments in practice moving forward where we're just getting four-man rushes in passing situations so our guys can get work on it. Now we can do multiple blitzes within the line instead of just one side or the other, as opposed to, like, the three-man front. We have stunts, but we also have the mono e mono stuff going on, too. UTEP defensive coordinator Mike Cox was a part of a defense at Kansas State that put up 24 sacks in 2017. So even a jump to that number would probably mean a couple more wins for the, the Miners. Season opens September 1st, first Northern Arizona at Sun Bowl.